add and if possible simplify y over y squared plus 6y plus 9 plus 1 over y squared plus 2y minus 3. To be able to add the two rational expressions, the denominators must be the same. We need to find the least common denominator. In order to do that, we need to factor both of the denominators. So let's write the equivalent rational expressions with factored denominators. So in the numerator, we have y. Here we have a perfect square trinomial, which factors as y plus 3 times y plus 3, plus 1 over. Then we factor this trinomial. It's going to equal y plus 3 times y minus 1. And now we can see that the LCD is equal to we need the y plus 3 times the y plus 3. And now when we go to the second denominator, we already have the y plus 3, but we need the y minus 1, so that's our LCD. Our next step is to write equivalent rational expressions for each of these, but that now have the LCD as the denominator. So what we would have then is this expression y over y plus 3 times y plus 3, we would have to multiply by y minus 1 over y minus 1. Plus, when we take this rational expression, 1 over y plus 3 times y minus 1, we would have to multiply numerator and denominator by y plus 3. So now, actually carrying out the multiplication of the numerators, we would have y times y minus 1 all over y plus 3 times y plus 3 times y minus 1. Plus, 1 times the y plus 3 is just y plus 3. And that's over y plus 3 times y plus 3 times y minus 1. Now that we have them over the same denominator, let's continue to simplify. So this would be equal to y squared minus y over y plus 3 times y plus 3 times y minus 1 plus and this is already simplified, y plus 3 over y plus 3 times y plus 3 times y minus 1. We can now add those numerators together. y squared minus y plus y plus 3 all over the LCD of y plus 3 times y plus 3 times y minus 1. And then we can combine the like terms, negative y plus y, they sum to 0. So we have y squared plus 3 over y plus 3 times y plus 3 times y minus 1. And that is as simplified as it can be.